Late in the season and way up in the race, a team is reminded not to take its eye off the ball. September 9th is a special day across Major League Baseball when we... Just about set to go now. And on the mound now, Luis Heal. A really good outing for him last time. Scattered two runs, was attacking hitters, getting ahead in the count. Great performance. We'll see if he can do it again in this one. Number 12 comes up empty with a swing there. Batting here with one away. The pitch. Hard grounder into the outfield for a knock. Here comes the runner. Way up the line, and the run scores. Mission accomplished there as he picks up the RBI to give him the lead. Wasn't able to elevate that one, but he sure hit it hard enough to get through the infield. There's not a whole lot of time for the defenders to react and try to make a play when it's ripped like that. On the ground to first, could be two. Goes to second for one. What a double play that was. Inning over. Man in scoring position with two away. Shohei Otani up to the dish. The designated hitter. Shohei. And the righty deals. Here's a high fly ball out to center. And that's the third out. Bottom of the fourth, digging in is the switch inning outfielder, number 12. Leading off for the Yankees. And he deals. The center fielder, number 12. And first offering is fouled off. Singy, four homers in 22 games at Old Yankee Stadium. What do you remember? Well, I remember my rookie year hitting two in one game. And, you know, before that game in the clubhouse, there was a gentleman there who owned a suit company there in downtown Manhattan. And he said to me, hey, kid, you hit a home run in the game tonight. Come over to the store tomorrow, and I'll give you a free suit. Here's a one-two. And a foul ball, he stays alive. So I went into the game, I happened to hit two. When I walked into the store the next day and he looked at me, he said, you're trying to put me out of business, aren't you? <laughs> and that was it. <laughs> that one is absolutely belted. And gone! That's what the fans came to see, his latest home. Number 12, stepping in now for the Yankees. The battle, number 12. Hey, let's go, let's put a charge into one right here, let's go. Well, hitter looked pretty comfortable on that swing. Pitchers don't like to see that. Let's see how he changes it up on this next pitch. Oh, one down. On the ground, right side. Could be extra bases. Coming home. He'll score easily, and they trail by one. Save. Picks himself up at RBI. Got the top of the ball a little bit, but not much. That was hit pretty far through the infield, so I think he'll be happy with that swing. Definitely generated some good. Runner on the go. That's in for a strike, and that's a stolen base, not even close. Well, he's really showing us the dynamic skill set he brings to the field on this one. Homered earlier, now he swipes second, showing off the speed. Really fun to watch him play the game. Out towards right center field. That's back. Out of here! That one barely got out of here. And they grab the lead. It's 6-4. Well, a pitcher always wants to miss down if he's going to miss. New inning getting started. And here's the first baseman, Nico Cavadas. The first baseman, number 12. That's out to center field. Number 12, under it. One down. So two away with nobody on. Now it's Ronaldo Hernandez. And a pitch. Now fly ball to right center. Number 12, gliding as he moves to his left. Makes the catch in and over. Red Sox go down quietly, and the score remains six. So one out, nobody on. Number 12 will hit next. The batter, number 12. And he grounds one to the right side. The flip to the pitcher covering. Pitcher gets to the bag for the out. 
Up next for the Yankees, the right fielder, Anthony. Now batting Tristan Casas. Story, the runner at first with one gone in the inning. The third baseman, Tristan Casas. Out there to center, number 12. Gets under it, makes the catch, and there's two down. Well, they win the opener at home. First game of the three-game series, and there's just such a good feeling when you're in your own ballpark, you're sleeping in your own bed, you're eating your clubhouse manager's food, everything's right in your world. And welcome into the ballpark. Batting third, the center fielder, number 12. And a foul ball. Next offering is foul back. Hey, see that? The other way. Oh, and two now. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. One, two, three, go the Yankees. So the Red Sox lineup turns over. So stepping in for Boston, Gilberto Jimenez. Gilberto Jimenez. This one popped up. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And that is that. Down in order go the Red Sox. And we are. Now it's the power speed combo. Number 12. Now that. Number 12. In the air, out towards right center. And that ends the inning. Yanks held in check. Still. Now, here is number 12. Pretty amazing athlete this guy is. Power and speed, quite a threat. I mean, you're talking about someone that could steal your bag and go deep. Bo Jackson, anyone? Foul ball. And now the 1. He swings and hits a fly ball. Center field. Jimenez in position. Makes the grab. And that is that. So the Yanks go in. And stepping in for Boston, Xander Bogarts. Who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. 2-2 two, two down. This to center field. Number 12 settles under this one. He makes the grab. And there's two away. Bottom of the eighth. And now it's going to be number 12. Mata back to work. Line drive. And that should be extra bases. Around first, heading for two. In there safely. You've got to get on your horse and get to that thing and get it back in because he's going to come barrel around first. He's going to put pressure on you. If you bobble it or you don't get there in a hurry, he's going to make you look silly and end up on second base. And now it's John Carlos Stanton. And the pitch. Rudder breaks for third. Strike in there. Pro save. I think he surprised everyone in the ballpark, and especially the pitcher. It wasn't a great lead there, but when he took off, I think he caught him off guard. Nice job to get to third. Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. Now one away. Man, I really like the ability to bounce back right there after not getting the call. He probably should have gotten. He didn't let it affect his focus, and he came back with another good pitch to get him swinging. He swings and drives one out to deep left field. Way back. And out of here. High fastballs, especially... With this one here today, you've won the first two games of this three-game series. So you would think the work is done, but when you're at home, I don't believe so. you got to come back with a mindset for game three that you want to win it and you're going to go out and do everything that it takes. You win like that. First pitch moments away and towing the slab. Davey Garcia. 
been a very solid pitcher throughout his career. ERA around three and a half. What I like is he competes, he stays in the game, and he gives his team an opportunity to win. Number 12 stands in here, leaves that one down. Hard ground ball, base knock. Really nice job staying up the middle with his approach. He didn't try to do too much with the pitch, just shot it through the infield. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. And sale deals. Swing and a high fly ball left field. Cordero makes the grab, and there's one down. That exists. The first base. One down. Now here is Trey Mancini. Sale delivers. That one is hammered right field back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. Well, I think the wind ended up being a factor right there. It's whipping in from right field right now. So otherwise, I think that ball's out of here. Runner at first with two away. And now Austin Hayes. This to third. In time to Arroyo. Inning over. One left for the Yankees. We'll move to the third with no score. Back at Yankee Stadium, stepping in the long ball threat, number 12. It's good speed at the top of the order here. You want to get it on, see if you can get a stolen base, maybe get around the bases and pick up a run. Sharp grounder, that's through for a base hit. Well, no waiting around right there. He was ready to swing it on the first pitch. Pretty tough for the infielders to do anything with that one. He pulled it hard into the outfield, and even when you keep it on the ground, it feels great when you hit a missile like that. Now a huge at bat in this game coming up. And there's one away. The batter, the first baseman. Trey Mancini now. Next pitch has popped up. Rafaela pulls it down. Two down. Now a throw to first, and he won't get back in time. It's a double play. We played four. It's the Red Sox one, and the Yankees nothing. One out, runner at second. Next to hit, number 12. Now that number 12. All right, your pitch right here, right now. Let's go. Intentional walk coming here, and that sets up the double play possibility with one away and runners at first and second. Anthony Santander at the plate. On the ground, two ball. Off balance speed, there's one, and that's two. Well, we can never overstate it. Pitcher's best friend right there. Double play, gets out of the jam, saves. And next for the Red Sox, Matt Veerling. Now back, the seventh unit. Matt Veerling. In the air out to center, number 12 under it. Puts the squeeze on that one, and there's one down. One down, runner at first. Number 12 now digs back. in now. He's not going to get cheated up there. No, he's not. He's looking to do damage with every swing he takes. Rip to first. Caught. Dives for the bag. Got him. Double play. Through eight full. All tied 1-1. Three to the final score for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Shambi. We'll see you soon. Our final line score.